so, now that you have two dead women on your hands, what are you doing about it? Everything we can will let us help. All you have to do is tell us what you got. <laughs> I'm going by the book on this one. Damn it, Derek, we can't afford to waste time. There are people out there who think we're pretty good at what we do. And if you've got some kind of serial killer on the loose, you're going to need all the help you can get. Especially two guys willing to go to the mat for people who meant the world to them. If I need any help, I'll be in touch. Until then, keep an eye on your loved ones. And stay out of my way. So, I don't know about you, but I get the feeling he's got nothing. Mm -hmm. So we're on our own. I'm going to take Doyle to the reception of Fusion. Yeah. You coming? Uh, no. I'll um, hang out here for a while. Like he's fading away someplace where nobody can reach him. What can we do? I could give him back his child. Do you have a new lead on Kate? No. Hey, I was wondering if you wanted to come back with me and see JR. I bought a bunch of Christmas gifts. Just stay here. Yeah, okay. Tell me about all the fun that you had with Spike and Miranda. Can you do that? Yeah? Why are we having a party today? Well, um, because Christmas is a time to show each other how much we love each other, and it's just really nice to spread it out. Okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay. What? What the hell do you want? I'm gonna hire you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, I'm sorry, but I think I'm booked. You don't even know what the job is. The only thing I know is I'm gonna find a son of a bitch who did this. It turns out that's not your battle, that's mine. That's why I need your help. What's going on here? I spend one night at your blackjack table. You think that I owe you? You're here to collect? Is that it? Oh, God forbid you're serious. You are serious. Well, what on earth could Mr. Know-it-all have that he would want to investigate? Me. Wait. Oh, it's okay. Babe knows me. George, it's, it's fine. This is my mother-in-law. Hi. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oof. Oh, nice to know that JR is uh, keeping you safe. Yeah. I just, I just needed to get some fresh air. I keep thinking if I stay up here long enough, maybe the cold will snap me out of this bad dream. Yeah. Well, I'm really, really sorry about what happened to your friends. If it's any consolation at all, I think you're handling it incredibly well. Seriously, you have no idea how many times I've been close to losing it. Well, I certainly couldn't tell, and I've been watching you. <laughs> You've been incredibly strong. I can tell you were really trying to be a good co-worker and friend, and mother, and especially a wife. 
Thank you. That really means a lot to hear you say that, keeping my marriage together and my family. It's what's most important. Well, I really admire your, your strength and your mother. I can really understand the choice that Crystal made. Choice? What choice? Not to tell Adam or Ted. You're a very bright man, a lot of resources. Why don't you use some of those resources and investigate this on your own? While you're at it, you could probably take a shot at making sense of you for the rest of us. Okay. Slater, if it has anything to do with Simone's murder, Aaron's, I want to hear about it. There's a message in this. In these murders, there's a message for me. What is that supposed to mean? When someone knows something about my past, something, someone. And yeah, I think it was a stranger to Aaron and Simone, but it's not a stranger to me. This is everything I know about me, past and present. Use it. Well, what I know about you is you're a very private man. You like it that way. How far do you want me to dig? No idea. Dig deep enough to find who we're looking for. Zach? You didn't answer the question. What's the link? Connection. What does this have to do with you? Gardenia and the single white river. The flowers and the white ribbon is uh, it's like a signature. How does that relate to you? You're the investigator. Figure it out. Okay. Let's say I do. Figure it out. I can make that connection. If I can, somebody else can too. And that someone is out there right now. Paul, although I'd have to say I'd make the same decision if I were in Crystal's shoes. You keep going on about Mama, but I don't care. Okay. I her. don't blame her. I mean, it would destroy Adam to find out that she was carrying Tad's child. 